Good day, YouTube. And the scientists tell us, the astrophysicists tell us, that iron is basically the final waste products of a star that is about to explode. So this is dead star, and we've learned how to make it into, uh, into boilers. And what you have here is the sneaky way that a typical pin-type boiler fails. This is a four-section boiler, or was, and the sections are joined together with a uh, top section there uh, with uh, the larger part, or the steam boiler, um, with what is known as a push nipple. And the push nipple is slightly beveled and fits in the space here, and this has been carefully machined. And when they machine this, they spray this down with oils, and that's the oils that need to be removed when you uh, start up a boiler and have to clean it. So this is rough casting, and this is then machined precisely uh, to fit this push nipple. And then there's the uh, bottom one there. There's the push nipple there. You see it's a little, a little rusty. And then there's the part where it goes in. It looks like it's been leaking. Um, and the hot gases pass up through here from the burners below. And this is called a pin-type boiler. Um, now, the way that steam boilers uh, fail that's really sneaky is that it will fail above the water line. So you won't see, at first, any water dripping below. Uh, everything will look normal. It just you'll you might notice you have to add a lot more water to it, and then you just start might notice that your radiators that used to heat great aren't heating so well anymore because there's just not enough steam. It's all going up the chimney. This is the flue passages here, and what would normally be in this space would be the flue collector, which would then gather the hot gases and send them up the chimney. And this has been leaking for a while, and. Um, Again, uh, you would very seldom see anything um, below until it's really bad. And so that's the sneaky way that steam boilers fail. You might want to know, well, which type of boiler is this, by the way? Uh, this is the infamous Burnham Independence. Some of you may know that the Burnham Independence seemed to have some, some trouble. In fact, uh, they stopped making this one and have... Uh, Go on to the new and improved version. So that's it. This one is the star junk is on its way to the scrap yard to be melted down into something more useful. I believe iron and steel is the most recycled material on earth and we're doing our part to help save the planet. Thank you all. If you have any comments or questions, likes or dislike, remember to Put your comments below and remember to hit that like button and I'll see you on the next one.